Hello guys, uh, today I have this clock movement, uh, this is actually a clock, but it doesn't have the dial, but what happened is that the hour hand and the minute hand, for some reason those gears broke off, but, uh, the rest of it, even though the hour and minute hands are broken, this clock still works okay, it, it runs on a D battery. And I'm not sure if you could see, but it's got a very unusual pendulum. I feel like I've seen that a couple other times, but I don't know what it is. Like, not from, not in my collection, but in, like, European collections and stuff. Uh, another thing is, um, how, uh, I can't believe that I actually got this for $5 since, uh, I don't know how much this would be worth in, if, in, uh, if they knew it was working. I don't know how much this would have been worth, but this was worth $5 at an antique shop, and I'm glad I have it, since I don't really know what it is, and I might be able to figure out, but, yeah. So, I'm going to be showing you the back right now. So, uh, you might be able to see, uh, how this, uh, uh, well, I, the pendulum is stopped right now, I just, no, it's not actually running, because I don't know why this clock is at, I don't know what's, uh, going on with this thing, but it only runs when it's forward. So, one of the things, uh, that I know is that uh, this little thing right here that's what you do to turn the time when, but unfortunately the minute and hour hand uh, the, the gears actually broke off and I don't know how to put them back on because I'm not good at repairing clocks yet uh, especially these since uh, I don't know what it is but it's actually a pretty cool clock since uh, I've never seen uh, I don't think I've seen any of any of them before, so I'm glad I got one. Uh, another thing I'd like to point out is that I'm not sure if it was meant to run on a D battery, but if it was, then uh, I'm glad I actually had D batteries that worked. Since this is actually one of the only clocks in my collection, not just one of the only, but the only clock in my collection that runs on D batteries. Uh, all the others run on C, AA, AAA, or cell batteries. But, um, and uh, I even have plug-ins and mechanicals, but a D battery clock is very rare for me. But... I am pretty glad I got this since, um, uh, I know that, uh, there might just be, I don't know where I, where else I'd find these, but if any of you do, then let me know, and, uh, I'm glad I could make this video for you guys. But you guys may remember this clock from a couple years ago. I just, uh, I actually had, I actually, uh, put it in my closet for a while, but I just found it again, so, um, it's gonna be out here, and, and then when I figure it out, I might try to repair it, but it actually works well, so, I hope you enjoyed this video, and, uh, well, I'll see you again sometime.